Hi there. My name is Elizabeth Middleton, and I'm majoring in Biological Sciences. My student dialogue was on Monday, September 19th, so it's November 25th now. So forgive me in advance for anything I say that isn't accurate. I'm probably going to say things in the wrong order because I'm going completely off of memory. <laughs> Um, our topic was called 10 Years After 9-11, Religious Pluralism in the United States. Um, so they, they said that they described this as 10 years later, the terrorist attacks of 9-11 continued to fuel rich dialogue on the form and function of religious pluralism in the United States. The freedom and expression of faith is among the most long-standing contentious social issues across the United States and the world. In this dialogue, participants are encouraged to explore the personal and global impact of 9-11 and its relationship to contemporary religious and political conflict. So, once everyone actually got into the room, I think the first discussion question the instructors asked was something along the lines of our earliest memories of 9-11, what we were doing, where we were. Um, and then they asked us um, when we actually understood what was going on. Um, with Iraq and the conflicts and the war. Um, but that was really about the extent of our involvement with the 9-11 incidents in the war because we pretty much just moved from there fully into religious pluralism. So one of the other initial questions they asked us was what was our first encounter with somebody of a completely different religion? So um, I think I I told them about in elementary school, one of my best friends was Jewish, so I learned more about that. Um, and then we went over setting ground rules for multicultural dialogues. They give us a handout for it. It looks like this, so you know. Um, we're also giving we we're also given a handout comparing debate, discussion, and dialogue, and they asked us to highlight what in the chart identified you the most. Um, I look like this. I highlighted most, most of my highlighting was for dialogue and discussion. Um, but so after talking about the handouts, we were asked to take our highlighter and marker, whatever you want to call it, and find one of the huge posters on the wall behind us and write out a timeline for religious, I guess, growth or, um, decline for whoever. They gave us a handout for that, too. It looked like this. Um, but so after that, then we were told that we had to share and discuss it with, like, two different people in the room. And then um, we got into groups of three, and they gave us another handout, which is like this. Religion X. And basically, we were just supposed to discuss what it, um, the little historical article and talk about the reflection questions. Um, so that was pretty much the majority of what actually happened during our new student dialogue. Um, I guess our group achieved dialogue to a degree because we achieved most of the key points in the, um, whatever, this worksheet. But, um... It was pretty quiet, really. Not that many people talked. We had, like, three or four active voices, I guess you would say. Um, I was kind of between active and reserved, because I gave, like, my opinion a couple of times, but not as much as the more active voices in the group. Um, I think the instructors wanted to discuss why we had mostly reserved voices, I think, they came to the conclusion that it was a sensitive topic that people felt that they had to be respectfully quiet about. Um, the new student dialogue was kind of interesting, but I don't really find it useful in any way. So, I guess that was just kind of that. Um, but I mean, it was interesting to hear what people had to say and what they thought about things. I think this actually, Religion X, I don't know if you can actually see that or not, um, I think it actually turned out to be like about, about Catholics maybe. I'm Catholic, but I guess it was from like way, way back in the day. 
Um, but we totally didn't get these reflection questions right. We were so confused. But maybe that was just my group. Um, but yeah, I was kind of disappointed that we didn't talk more about the 9-11 incidents because that was what I was more interested in was, you know, I always want to learn more about about that historical part because it was a big part of our lives. But it was mostly just about religion. That was pretty much it. Alrighty, bye.